What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to use for loops in Roblox Studio. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're obviously going to put the parts, the lights, all that into your car. Now, I, I do stage 3 scripts, so I already have stage 1 and stage 2 scripted here. So pretty much what I'm going to be doing in this video is st scripting stage 3 with you. And instead of going like a normal, you know, flash back and forth pattern, we're going to be doing a for loop pattern. Which pretty much what it does is it makes it flash three times on one side, and then flash three times on the other side. So what it does is it does that in amount of a time. So say we do 0 0.3 seconds. So it'll flash three times in 0 0.3 seconds, and then flash three times on the other side in 0 0.3 seconds, if that makes sense. So, what we're going to be doing here is now what we're going to do is we're going to type for loop equals one slash dat one comma three do. And then what you can do is you can go ahead and take your pattern that you got up here and paste. Now, I'm going to go ahead and be creating a pattern here. You can do any pattern really. I'm just going to be doing a simple pattern. And I'm gonna go ahead and do the time as 0.4. I suggest you do that. It's a really good pattern for uh, for loop patterns. So now, that once you have that scripted, what you're gonna do, you're gonna enter and paste that down here. But instead of doing the opposite, what you do is you change all of these to one. Normally, on a normal script, like as you can see up here, I did this and then I did the opposite. So instead of doing that, you put all ones now. Under this end here, you're going to click on, on the end of the end and hit enter. So it's going to bring you down one. So you're going to get what you're going to do is you're going to do for loop equals one comma three do and go ahead and paste your pattern again. And this is where you're going to do the opposites. So this is where I'm going to do all my opposites. And go ahead and hit enter under that. Do the same thing, paste it, and change this all to one. Now, if you don't know what the zero means, it's like zero means it's on, which would so zero means it's not transparent, and the one means it's completely transparent. So, pretty much what you're doing here is it flashes three times here and then goes completely transparent, and then it goes to the second other pattern. <laughs> now, under this end. On the end of this end, hit enter, hit backspace, and go else, enter, paste, get rid of it. You can keep the wait time, I like to get rid of it, and then change this all to one. So, like so. Now that you have that, you can go ahead and exit out. And if you go ahead and go into your game, it's now you will have your loop patterns. So, as you can see, I already have the stage one and stage two. But here's your loop patterns. So as you can see here, it flashes three times here, and then flashes three times here, and then flashes three times here. So it's gonna do that for every time. So what you what it does is it flashes three times over here and waits 0 0.04 seconds and does the same thing over here and then does it in the middle and does the same thing. Now, so that is how you do your forward loop patterns in Roblox Studio. If you have any questions, go ahead and join my Discord server. I will leave the link in the description. Um, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.